My name is Amina and I'm 3 years old. I come from a place called Kibara in Kenya. My mom always told me that my name means the one who brings peace because she said I was a gift from God during difficult times. She would tell me every day that God loves me and that I am special to Him. One day, our neighborhood faced a big problem and everything changed for us. There was a huge fire and everything turned into chaos. My mom tried to take me somewhere safe, but in a panic, I got lost in the crowd. I was just a little girl and I didn't know what was happening. They took me to a strange place with many other girls who were just as scared as I was. In that place, they told me I wouldn't see my mom again and that I had to work and obey. They said terrible things, making me feel like I wasn't worth anything. Sometimes. I felt alone and sad, and I wondered if God had forgotten about me. But deep in my heart, I could hear my mama's voice telling me that God loved me. Every night, I imagine God looking for me without giving up, knocking down every barrier to find me. I felt that He still cared for me, even when I felt small and helpless. One day, good people came to that place and rescued us. They told me I was safe now and that I would see my mom soon. Now, I'm here on America's Got Talent because I want to sing a song that reminds me that God never stopped looking for me. I want to sing Reckless Love because it reminds me that God's love is stronger than anything, that He never gives up and does everything possible to find us. I want other kids to know that they are valuable and that there's a great love that will always look for them, no matter where they are. Before I spoke a word, you were saying over me, you have been so, so good to me. Before I took a breath, you breathed your life in me. You have been so, so kind to me Oh, the overwhelming, never-ending, reckless love of God It chases me down, fights till I'm found Leaves the 99, I couldn't earn it I don't deserve it, still you give yourself away Oh, the overwhelming, never-ending, reckless love of God
wall you won't kick down No lie you won't tear down Coming after me My name is Kofi, and I'm three years old. I come from a small village in Ghana called Tamale. My life was very happy when I was with my mom. She told me every day that I was strong and brave and that I could do great things. She called me her little hero. But one day, something bad happened. My dad got sick, and we didn't have money to help him. My mom was very sad and worried, and I didn't know what to do. Some people came to our house and told my mom that I could go with them to work to earn money and help my family. My mom didn't want to, but they said it would only be for a little while. They took me to a faraway place where there were other children working all day. I was scared and didn't understand why I couldn't go home. They told me I wasn't enough, that I needed to be stronger and do more work. But I felt small and weak. Sometimes I thought maybe I wasn't special or good enough. But in my heart, I heard my mom telling me that I was brave. And even though I didn't understand everything, I felt that God was telling me I was loved. A song played in my head saying that God saw me differently than the bad men did. It made me feel a little better, even though I was sad. One day, good people came and rescued us. They told us we were important and that we were not alone. Now I'm here on America's Got Talent to sing a song that helped me not lose hope. I want to sing You Say, because it reminds me that even when I feel small and scared, God tells me that I am strong and loved. I want other kids to know that they are not alone, that they are special and loved by God, no matter what others say.